Well, hello there, strangers on the internet. This is Dark Souls Arch Thrones, the new mod to Dark Souls 3. And holy shit, it is loud. Now, I remember watching a gameplay trailer for this a long time ago. It adds a lot of new locations, uh, new weapons and so on, new boss fights. It's actually made in the style of Demon Souls, as you can obviously see by the title screen. I think there are a few different Arch Thrones that you activate and get transported into different locations. And that's pretty much all I know about this mod. And this is actually only just a demo, so not even a full release yet. So without further ado, let's begin the new game. When the chosen savior oh. turned away from his duty, the firekeeper took charge. It even has new cutscenes. And five kingdoms gifted her five thrones to aid in the firelink ritual and receive beautiful souls art as well. Brought by an emissary of emeralds. The Firekeeper's Champion. I honestly wasn't expecting to see something like this. And here we go, already new armor that looks very cool. Actually, actually looks like something out of straight out of Demon Soul. A knight. A fugitive with a... Oh. <laughs> I do not envy this guy. Imagine fighting in a real war with this. A duelist with a cool looking rapier and a parent shield. A scholar with a stupid fucking head. A pyromancer, not many changes here. A priest with a big ass hammer, mace. Looks very painful. An outcast with a staff and a saber. A hunter with a bow and a dagger. And a crestfallen with a spear and a shield. And of course, our old friend Deprived. They all kind of look very cool. The knight's the most cool looking one, to be honest. But I think the outcast has the best weapon, the one that I would like to try the most, as well as the new type of sorceries. So I think I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna pick him even though he looks ugly as fuck. And uh, let's pick an appropriate name for this for this fella. What would be a fitting name for someone who, was, who had been outcasted? Say hi to Tommy, guys. I guess black firebombs? And um, I'm not really gonna... <laughs> worry about the looks that much. I usually just pick like a, a standard face and just change hair. I don't understand why people torture themselves by spending an hour on the character creation screen trying to build an absolute monstrosity. Uh, the Tommy is like a kind of a young name so... But he has an old soul so I think his voice should match. But let's also give him a large head. I think that was the reason he was outcast in the first place. And I think we're done. I wonder where we're gonna start. Oh, a new loading thing as well. I wonder where we're gonna start. It seems like I was correct. Huh. This is exactly where Demon Souls starts. And. Everything is so goddamn loud. Oh, what's this? Champion's Kindling. Further increased maxed HP while Embered. That's nice. I have... no, no rings. Oh, I need to... oh... That's right. Can I change that really quickly? Because I've been playing Elden Ring. Oh, I think I'm getting killed. Yeah. 
Yeah, this looks almost exactly like the, uh, the tunnel is like uh, almost the exact same as in Demon Souls. I don't understand why they bothered with the putting tutorial messages here. Maybe just for authenticity. Uh, my camera also moves uh, slower than usual. I think because all of my settings uh, have been reverted, because this uh, mod uses a separate save. Black Soul Orb. Let's read on that lore. Forbidden dark sorcery employed by hollow magicians. Fire the Black Soul Orb. The power of hollow sorcery is rooted in the most mysterious origins of man. Something so essential, yet so elusive. Luck. That's cool. Oh, I don't like that. Are you sleeping or just pretending? Hey, yeah. Eat my fucking blade. Oh, I was so lucky to be out of range. This motherfucker almost killed me. I really need to watch my stamina because, as I said, I've been playing Elden Ring. And in that game, you can swing fucking forever. In this game, you use your sword twice and you're already out of stamina. I think these guys are chill. By which I mean they're fucking dead. A broken straight sword. Oh, hello. Ah, oh, they have. They've added a uh, fucking. This. Well, I don't know what it's called, but they've added it. Also, my camera bounces off the walls. No. Oh, and a fog wall. I'm assuming this is where I get my shit kicked in. Oh, this looks creepy though. Really good atmosphere so far. Okay, scary sounds. Demon Vanguard. Hello, long time no see. I wonder if it's even possible to kill it. Am I supposed to kill it? What? <laughs> uh, what's your bet on when you get close to killing him, he actually just explodes and kills you anyway? And then the game starts for real. That's the wrong button. Oh shit. Uh, the hitbox on this felt a bit earlier. Oh shit. You know what? I should have probably transferred my game from my HDD to my SSD for this one because I don't really know how well it's optimized, but I don't want to spend a lot of time looking at a, at a loading screen, which is what I think is going to happen if, I, if I'm going to die a lot. Okay, I just woke up two times in a row, uh, which is what usually happens to me in real life. How did I end up in this place? What's the lore behind this? And why is this door so heavy? It's just wooden planks. Am I in a table of lost grace now? Where is my binoculars at? Hello? I have a cool hat. 
Oh, dear, forgive me. Oh, dear. I Do you want to offer me miracles? If you wish to learn, I can teach you. If you'd like. I do not know if I fully trust you. If we're going by, you know, returning to the to the source. The first cleric you meet in Dark Souls 1 is a fucking traitorous bastard. Okay, nothing interesting ah, for me. Good pupil. Miracles are tales of the gods and their kin. Blessings granted to us through faith. Most miracles are ancient. Written at the dawn of the Age of Fire, after the Great War. As such, there are miracles for almost every purpose. Every miracles purpose, you say? Miracles for combat, miracles for healing. There are even miracles for teleportation. And Master Ben. Oh, shall I share more on the matter? Very well. Long ago, Kesa, the goddess of tears, was feared as an omen of death. Reem, oh my the god. <laughs> the I should just stop. Previously, the so-called Allfather, Lloyd, judged humanity by the law of my soul. Before... Okay, now he's just repeating, Farewell. so... Varian Ver Nux, does this open? Oh, d don't give me fucking options. <laughs> Oh, this is filing shrine. Okay, so what's what's here then? God, I look so fucking. St oh. Just when I'm about to insult my own appearance, there's the fucking drippiest guy ever. I see the dark has sparked within you. Become my people and accept this sacred sigil of darkness. Only then will you be able to discover true power. Does it, does it come with the uh, your clothes? You are now my apprentice, and together we my shall apprentice. explore the depths within our tired flesh. You now walk the path of a hollow. I don't don't know what I just did, but oh, he gives you. Hollow sorceries. I wonder if I kill him. Does he give me his armor? Ah, oh, holy shit, that's so fucking. So many NPCs. Speaking of armor, wrap worn by London's penitent, designed to blind its wearer. The Sable Church teaches an old adage that in suffering mankind finds its strength. And an emissary helm. A beautiful steel helm with a golden grill adorned with green dyed feather plumage. Symbolic of the lush nexus and the emerald flasks that are treasure to all undead. This is the celebrated armor of the, of the first emissary of embers, granted as a token of victory. Much like an Estus flask, the emerald green waist cloth was hand wow was hand woven by the firekeeper herself. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Don't mind if I do. I hope I can oh sixty-nine point eight. Nice. I don't recall seeing you before. Are you new here? Tell the truth? Well, I, I don't even know what the truth is. The name is Thomas. I'm certainly no stranger. Thomas. In this nexus. If you plan on visiting... Is that the name of the NPC in the... To lend you in the Demon Souls? If you have any baggage in need of storage, allow me to ease your burden. Rest assured, your goods are safe and sound with me. There's not much else I'm good for, I'm afraid. Uh, so what's in your chest there, buddy? These all look so epic. I don't know what this is. The throne is shattered with many small cracks. I think this is the Launder Arch Throne. There's a similar 
shape to the ceremonial, ceremonial sword that you can get. Oh, look at the sky. Oh, fuck. This is so pretty. That's a beautiful looking snake. Who made all those models? Well, except the, the face. <laughs> None of these are active now. Oh, that's the, <laughs> the sculptor. Greetings. I am Embrius. I am Embrius. Well, before it fell. I Just pick it up. Andre, my friend. Well, you must climb on if you're required. Okay, so he has no new dialogue. Oh, he transposes your weapons. And this is our firekeeper. Welcome to the Nexus, lost soul. Oh, she Welcome also has a new voice. A coiled lost sword. Soul. Produce the coiled sword at the bonfire with the seal of the Nexus upon thee. The Arch Thrones will allow travel to other worlds. If thy burden weigheth heavy, then mayst thou find here a place to rest. Yet I pray thy feelings differ for the sake of all undead. The fire must be linked once more. If thou wouldst become an emissary. I would so love to fucking voice act in one of those type of games. Or any game, really. Even though I fucking suck as an actor. I suck at talking in general. Even more so when I have to re read the script. Oh, shit. <laughs> in accordance with the Emissary's Oath, your soul is now bound by the Nexus. Travel can be n now can be accessed from behind the Arch Thrones. Can I use this? What did I just get? Uh, an emerald shackle. A mysterious cuff reminiscent of the firekeeper's crown. Disappears when observed, but weighs heavy on the wrist of any emissary who falters in their mission, much like a curse. The firekeeper has no name for she, has, for she was born and raised for her duty. Her resolve, unlike any other, has led to both tragic downfall and triumphant, and triumphant victory for many wayward undead. Can I choose any Arch Throne now? I would assume not, because this is just a demo. But it looks like... Uh, I want to choose this one so badly. Oh, I... I thought it would give me a choice first. Okay, let's see how fast I die. What on village? No? What? Fuck. <laughs> uh, the game just crashed. Let's try that again. Shall we? Unless I find a bonfire. Man, the FPS... <laughs> dips very much in this place. Of the ambient music in the background. Make an offering. I have nothing to offer. So it would seem. Any secrets? <laughs> I almost walk walked past the bonfire. There's a crystal lizard that I can't chase because of this guy. Oh, they actually kill each other. This is my chance. Fuck, kill it! <laughs> Chill out! This is bad. This is bad! This is okay. Shit. No! If that would have killed me, <laughs> I would not be. The fuck is this? Oh, that's the. Don't scream. Yeah. 
I will need you to separate. Are they even smart enough to climb this? Hello? Okay, they have no health, it seems. Angel feather. Are these supposed to be angels? Gradually restores HP when mixed in. Oh. This game has a flask system. So remember how I said I don't know if this mod is well optimized or not. Uh, turns out it is not well optimized because... Uh, let me just show you. So every time I'm in this area and I'm looking that way, my GPU usage goes way up to 100%. Uh, so I had to turn my shadows off because that was the only solution that I could find. Uh, I was either doing that or I'm just gonna... <laughs> I would have to mo moonlight walk into, into that territory. So hopefully it's alright now and my camera doesn't lag. Yeah, it's a pity that I had to turn my shadows off because without them the game kinda looks a bit ugly. So whatever there is, it has a very huge impact on performance. Maybe it's these barrels, you know? We don't know what's inside them. Maybe each barrel contains like 500 pickles. And uh, which is strange because every developer knows that you empty your barrels. Holy fuck! Before uh, placing them, 